Hey there everyone, welcome back to a special episode of uh, Pokemon Heart Gold. Today, you may ask yourself, Tom, why do you have an Arceus as your back Pokemon? Well, I'll tell you, today is going to be a special episode because of I am going to do an event that it will be involving the Pokemon Arceus. Now, before people go like, it's pronounced Arceus, it's pronounced Arceus, four kids is terrible, okay? It's Arceus. Um, anyway, this particular Arceus event, um, it's one of the most epic events that you'll see, like, in anything ever. It's one of the most, like, just visually fantastic events you'll ever see in a Pokemon game. Also, I'm going the wrong direction. You go up here, and some guy busts open the door. This is the ruins of Alf, by the way. You okay? I was in a hurry. I'm sorry, did I hurt you? <gasps> no way! Could it be a Pokemon from Sinnoh? The one they call Arceus? And also, the reason why I know um, it's Arceus is because its Japanese name is Arusius, and it's spelled R-U-S-E-U-S, -E so... Yeah, it's Arceus. Arceus may be the key to solving the mystery of the unknown in the ruins of Alf. You do come to the ruins of Alf with me, please. You must trembling with excitement. Yeti, yeti, yeti. I love this music. It's so fucking creepy. I don't really. I have been studying the ruins for many years, but something feels different. <gasps> Wow! The unknown pictures on the wall! Feels like they're staring at me! Oh god, what? What is this? There's something eerie that is making my legs shiver. I can't stop them! Whoa. What is this place? Cool. Whoa, who are you? Who the hell? Well, hello! It's so freezing, isn't it? For a youngster like you to be interested in the Sinjo ruins? Sinjo ruins? Like Sinnoh and Johto? Take a look at them. From the design of the pillars of the Sinjo ruins, you can see that the cultures of Sinnoh and Johto have blended. What was I thinking? We don't need to be standing here. Why don't you come to the cabin around the corner for more discussion? Um... What? What the fuck is going on here? Like... Who, who are you? By the way, we happen to have a person at the cabin. Any trainer should know... The, wait. Wait. Cynthia? Question mark? Cynthia's here? Wait, is it Cynthia? Yeah, would you look at that? It's Cynthia. Cool. Hi, Cynthia. My name is Cynthia. I'm a Pokemon trainer. The Sinjo ruins remind me of Sinnoh, where I came come from. Initially, I thought it was because it snows a lot here as well. But that was not it. A long time ago, people came from Sinnoh to live here. They have, must have built a temple here while longing for their homes. That's why we call the the, the Sinjo Ruins or whatever. You are a Pokemon trainer? I can sense strong power co coming from your Pokeball. I feel a similar, a familiar presence. The power of Dialga, Palkia, or could it be Giratina? It's similar, but not quite the same. Have you got time? Can you come to the Sinjo Ruins with me? Call it a trainer's intuition. With you and your Pokemon, when you and your Pokemon step onto that stage, something will happen. I guess she's a weirdy. Okay, uh, let's talk to you. A long time ago, people used to draw life from Pokemon and also give their lives to those Pokemon. That shows that people and Pokemon used to be more closely bonded with each other. When people move from place to place, the myths and legends of Pokemon and their power would also be carried with the, those people. That's how myths and legends from each re region are blended with each other. The ancient ruins here have inherited the legends with, from both the ruins of Alf in Johto and the Spear Pillar in Sinnoh. That is proof that people from Johto and Sinnoh blended together as a group. Now who are... what is this? Is this an Abra? Oh wait, yeah, he can teleport you back. That's right, yeah. He can teleport you back. Anyway. So now, as Cynthia stated, let's go back to the ruins. This is the mistry stage. The mythical state. 
mythical stage built to show respect for Arceus. It is said that people who used to celebrate its magnific magnificent might with music and dance. Some people in Johto still pass down this tradition. According to an ancient document, time, space, and antimatter, or what combined or what combined we call the world, shall be born when Arceus stands at the, on the Mistry stage. This is where one might say the, the lead enters the Mistry stage at last. All, of, all my study of ruins and Pokemon mythology have, may have been to bring you up on this stage here today. Cool. Depicted on the Mistry stage are, are the Pokemon that shape this world. The circle in the middle is Arceus, the origin of it all. This is the pattern that represents Palkia, the master of space and dimensions. This is the pattern that represents Dialga, the guardian of time. This is the pattern that represents Giratina, the ruler of the world that is on the opposite side of ours, the world of antimatter. Arceus has accepted you as a trainer. Arceus, having shaped the world, is said to show you a glimpse of its true power. The power of possibly making life appear out of nothing. It seems that something will happen when you choose one of the circles. You want to be well prepared. I think I'll choose Palkia. So you choose Palkia, the master of space and dimensions. Now Arceus will go into the center and be prepared for the epicness. The mysterious round object took the shape of a Pokemon. Tom obtained the Palkia! Wow, that e m event is epic as hell. No, I will not nickname it. Wow! <laughs> Did we just witness the very moment an egg was brought into this world? A moment no one has ever seen? An egg is the cradle of every being. This planet itself is an egg in a sense. Life that comes from an egg will come to an end in due course, to begin anew. That is what that may be what Arceus wanted to show us. The hell is going on? That was we seem to be surrounded by that strong power again. Ah. Ah, hi. Oh, you are, are you alright? You disappeared right in front of me. I was so surprised. I see. The power of Arceus and Unknown affected each other to create a huge energy, which sent you to the Sinjo Ruins? 
Unknown, the ruins of Alf and Arceus. The mystery deepens. It has made me even more inquisitive. I will one day solve all of the mysteries. Wow. Now then, moment of truth. Let's check the Palkia. It has an item. It's a quiet nature. Eh, it's alright. Not bad. You know, I've seen better Palkias, but you know what? I wasn't going for nature, and I don't plan on going for nature. If I want a pal good Palkia with, uh, with Hydro Pump, I'll just go to Poke and Save. So, anyway, I am... We know, Unknown won't appear, will it? It won't appear unless you do the whole, hello, I am doing the uh, thing. So, anyway, yeah, this is the Unknown Ruins. It's, uh, it's creepy. It's, like, really, like... Actually, I'm having kind of difficulty trying to find the ladder, like... <laughs> but once I find the ladder, I'll get out of here, and, uh... Yeah, I'll get out of here, and then end the episode, because... Yeah, oh, there it is. So, yeah. So now we have exited the ruins of Alf and the Sinjo ruins. And I think I will call it an episode there. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see y'all next time.